rise up. You know, you had quite an intense experience mm. from media mm. to social media, you know, in terms of being bullied and stuff online. Can you tell us a little bit more about that experience? Well, the word bully didn't really work on me. Yes, <laughs> yeah. It's just irritating, boring, stupid. And I think just inconsiderate of people who've not got better things to do with their time. That's what I called it for mm. myself. I just thought education is key. Yes. You know, where there's no knowledge, people will perish. And so exactly. I think before they could even begin, those who bullied or thought they were bullying, mm. uh, what they should have done is gone, gotten tested for everything they accused me of themselves and then come and talk to me about what they think of me exactly. or anybody else they've bullied before. Um, but I, I'm just against it in the sense that I just think it's inconsiderate. I think it's inhuman. When you don't understand what's going on in someone, how, what happened to sympathy? What happened to Ubuntu? What happened yeah. to just to supporting your fellow South yeah, African exactly. and saying, you know what, whatever it is that you're going through, I wasn't saying pray for me. I was just saying, you know, just say we understand. Mm, yes. You yeah. made a choice to lose weight. I would rather you say, hi, I mean, I think you took it too far or mm. whatever. And I say, but I'm comfortable with it. So tell us about that weight loss journey. You know, when you were diagnosed with diabetes, mm. Mm. how did that kind of progress until your fabulous self? Well, remember, for me to even become a diabetic myself, I actually was overweight for many, many years after my son was mm. born, which was like probably 18 years later. I suddenly woke up and thought, yo, I feel obese. I, I look obese. I go to see dietitians and they say, mm. according to the scale, you are, you are, like you are obese, mm. 20 kgs over. And I'm like, So huh? you must actually mm. listen to those Yeah, scales. yeah. So I listened and I thought, okay, let me change my lifestyle. But, you know, it wasn't easy. You do this diet, you do that diet, yes. it doesn't work, you do that diet. And eventually, I got dizzy walking somewhere and bam, hi, you're diabetic now. Mm. Please do take care of your health. Jeez. You can't eat this, you can't eat that. And it had to stop. Yeah. So I had to regroup and change my eating lifestyle. And hence, I look fabulous. Rise up.